So let's see if the third time is a charm. I think it's gonna be. So hey guys, welcome. This is Monica. I am going to share with you three things in this video. One is about the Olay Pro Retinol Eye Treatment. The other is my eyelash serum. And the third one is something that a YouTuber just influenced me totally to buy. So if you are curious, please stay tuned. But before you do that, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Please hit the like button. Please leave me a comment and ring that little bell so you'll be notified when I upload. That said, here's the scoop, guys. So many of you know that I have been using this Olay Eye Treatment. This uh, It's called the Olay Pro Eye Treatment. I've been using this since February. There have been many other YouTubers that have actually talked about this and some of them have absolutely raved about this as being the miracle eye cream. And so of course, you know, I um, I had bought it actually before I saw those videos, but of course that kind of like made me feel really excited because I'm like going, yeah, hey, I'm using something that, you know, we have we have uh, Nisha, Sugar Puff and Fluff, raving about how great it was. And then Nadine, the beauty know-it-all as well. And I'm like thinking, okay, so, you know, I gotta, I gotta be on the right path here. And then I realized there was a little bit of a difference between the European version and the US version. And I was dying to get my hands on the European version because I wanted to see if this was like the next best thing to slice bread. So anyways, my YouTube friend, Gail, from Random Life Productions, lives in London. We were chatting and I said, you know, if you could find this cream for me and send it to me. I'd be more than happy to reimburse her for all her expense, but if you could find it and send it to me, I would be so, so happy. And she did, and it just arrived yesterday. So Gail from Random Life Production sent me this, and I'm gonna link her channel. If you do not know Gail, she's not a beauty channel. Her channel is a little bit about the randomness of life. She's a lovely lady. She shares a lot of her adventures. She's well-traveled. So I just love seeing a little bit of the different parts of the world through her eyes. So Gail sent me this. I haven't used it yet. I have been using this, the American version of the Olay Pro Retinol Eye Treatment for since February, since my birthday actually. And I've actually had already bought a backup, which I think I shared with everybody. So the big difference is the, you know what they make? Here's the box it came in. And I don't know if you can see, but there is like a silhouette outline of a tube right here. And it's sort of like brownish in color. And the list of ingredients is also brownish in color. So I used my eyeglasses. I used my magnifying glass to try to read these ingredients. And I couldn't read them. I mean, you know, I know I have old lady eyes, but I could not read them. So anyways, I hunted down off their website the list of ingredients from the European version of the Olay Eyes Pro Retinol. And the white tube is the European version, the red tube is the US version. And I'm going to, I've got the US version, the US version and the European version, list of ingredients. I'm gonna put them down in the description box below. I'm not a chemist, I'm not an expert. I copied those ingredients directly from a website. I cannot authenticate anything except that I copied it from their website. So I'm hoping that it's accurate list of ingredients. The difference that I am seeing is the order of most of the ingredients. There seems to be a higher order of some really good ingredients in the European version. It could be their standards, it could be anything, I don't know. But I have not tried it yet. I'm looking forward to trying it. I, um, I will tell you that since February I've been using this. Is it a miracle? I wish. I wish I could say it was. No, it's not a miracle for me. Maybe this will be, I don't know. But I like it enough. And and, and yes, I, I started to notice a little bit of peeling. I mentioned that in a previous video. And um, and that and that was okay. I um, I like it enough to have bought a second bottle, a second tube of it, and to keep using it. I do feel, and they say this is for your deep wrinkles, and I was putting it on lower, and now I'm just going up higher and all around and really concentrating on my deep wrinkles. And then I've been using this baby 
and rubbing it in. So this is a jade roller that Susan from Little Poet influenced me to buy. And you know what, when she was talking about this, I was like, oh, really? No, nope. you know, but then I bought it. I, it is so, um, I can't even describe it. It's so amazingly soothing. And I can, you know, really very, very gently massage around my eyes. And that's what I've actually been using to apply this. But the other thing that she inspired me to buy was this carrot seed oil. She raved about it. She thought it was really, really good. So yeah, I was influenced to the Jade Roller and the carrot seed oil. And maybe there's been other women that have talked about the Jade Roller too. I'm not too sure. I'm sure there have been and I forgot. But so I was influenced by Susan, little poet, to buy this. This is too new for me. I've only been using it for like maybe two weeks. So I don't know. I couldn't tell you one way or the other. I like it. It seems to be very nice. But I couldn't tell you anything beyond that yet. But this, I can tell you almost right away. I'm loving, loving how I apply that. So that was, I think, pretty cool. The third thing that I want to tell you is the eyelashes. So I've been on, and I'm going to link my playlist, and I'm going to link Carol from the O'Carroll Show because we did a collab on eyelash serums. I'm going to link all of that information below as well as the details on everything else in Gail's channel and Little Poet's channel. But anyways, I have been on an eyelash journey, and I'm not going to go back into history and tell you. I'm going to show you right now what my eyelashes start, looked like in 2016 before I used any kind of an eyelash serum. Now, I'm not a great photographer, so the lighting is different in some of the photos. The poses are different. It's just the way it is. But in 2016, when I took this picture, I never thought I'd be flashing it to the world like I am. But in 2016, you can see I really did not have any decent eyelashes. I didn't. I started CarePost. I was so excited. Here's my progress, as you can see in these photos. I was on CarePost for a while. I loved it. I got to the maintenance level of CarePost. I did that for a long, long time. And then I always said when I ran out of my supply, I was going to try to give my CarePost a rest. I started something called Lash Tonic, and this is where Carol from the O'Carroll Show and I kind of did sort of a comparison collab. Not really a collab in the traditional sense, but her findings and my findings. And so I used that, and I didn't, it did not live up to its expectations. It did not live up to the claims the product had. So, it, you know, it was okay, it was nice, but I would not buy it again. I would not continue to use it. I saw no dramatic improvement. Of course, to start with, my eyelashes were pretty good, but I also noticed that they were, uh, when I had a fallout, I wasn't having the regrowth. So once I finished that, I had been sent, and I mentioned this, I'd been sent this free, this product called Blink. I'm going to link their website, guys, because you really should check out their website. They have some really good detailed instructions or just information on how eyelash serums work, um, how, you know, the cycle of an eyelash, you know, the fallout, all of that stuff. Is, they've got a really good website. I've contacted them. I've asked them for a coupon. I haven't heard back. If there's any kind of a discount coupon code, I'll put it in my description box. But they sent me five bottles of this free to try. I've finished one bottle. I'm on my second bottle. This is three months into it. Now my feelings are, the, the main thing that I've noticed from Blink compared to CarePost is that my natural lashes are darker. And that was like, that was like really weird to me to have darker natural lashes. I didn't notice anything anywhere else. I mean, I have redness around my eyes, but I've always had certain redness around my eyes. I have freckles on my eyelids. I've always had freckles on my eyelids. Uh, so never really noticed any other kind of issues with either the CarePost or the Blink. But the Blink was, <clears throat> you know, basically darkening my natural lashes and I believe it helped grow in all those little sparse areas. Now I'm going to include these pictures. You can see my progress all the way along. One thing I will tell you from January to um, to February when I was using the the um, other product, there wasn't any anything else. There was no regrowth. There was no vavum. But when I started with the Blink, I started to see that my lashes were growing longer and since the time I've been using the Blink in the three months, I've had to trim them twice so far. So I probably am due for another trim. I have rogue lashes that just kind of go all over the place um, and I trim them down. So how am I liking this? You know, this is, you can buy this in the U.S. It's a little bit more expensive than buying a product over in India, but you have FDA, you have a lot of different things. Check out the website. I'm not an expert. Check it out. 
but this is a generic Latisse type of a product and I'm liking the results. So for those of you that you don't want to buy stuff overseas, you don't want to take that risk, this might be a great alternative because they have a U.S. distributor. And there is some sort of a club. There is a uh, offer right now. You can get one free apparently on their website. I noticed that. So if you want to check it out, check it out. But my results, because this is highly requested by many of you, after three months, I am seeing the same results that I have seen when I was using my Care Pros. Lash regrowth, this is filled in, and it seems to be a thicker line of lashes that's shorter little lashes as they're growing out. It's filled them in really, really nice. So I'm, not, I'm happy with this, I really am. I have three more bottles, so I'm gonna be using this for a while, and I will report back periodically how it continues to go. But so far, it's really, I think it's really great. And, um, and yeah, this little contraption is like really cool. It's like, ooh, I'm liking it. So thank you, Gail. This is amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm super happy with this. I can't wait to give it a, a try and let you all know if there's a big difference. I'm gonna link the, the ingredients, like I said, so you can check it out. But um, yeah, I just wanted to give you that really quick update and hopefully, hopefully, this OAI will be my miracle. <laughs> I'll be able to say the European version is the miracle, but I am liking the US version. I really am, and I'm gonna to continue to use both, so. That's it for me, guys. Thanks so much for hanging in there for the whole video, and I truly appreciate every single one of you. Bye, guys.